Hey YouTube, welcome to STW. For the first episode of the channel, I wanted to talk about ATK versus DMG increases, how they're different, how they're the same, and which one is better for your account. To do that, I'm going to do a little bit of math in the beginning, and then we're going to apply what we learned in the actual in-game scenario. So without further ado, let's get to it. For the sake of this example, let's assume that ATK is attack, DMG is damage, and the total amount of hit points you get to hit your opponent for is going to be referred to as output. So now, imagine you have 100 base output. Let's assume we are going to get 50% ATK boost added towards our final output. So 100 plus 50%, 50% 50 of 100 is 50, so that's 150. But what if we need to convert that 50% into a multiplier? That will be 1.5. So 100 times 1.5 is 150 output. Easy peasy lemon squeezy. But what if now we have 20% DMG increase? So now that 20% will become 1.2 multiplier. So that's going to be 100 times 1.5 times 1.2 equating to 180 output. Notice how we didn't just add that 20 towards 50 and just took 70% out of 100 because that will mean that attack and damage are essentially the same multiplier, which they're not. Let's apply what we just learned to the actual in-game scenario. So in order for us to actually calculate the proper values for our account, we need to know what the current stats are. And to do that, we go into account, your profile, uh, go to stats so now what we need is the all units atk bonus which is 110.5 percent for me and we're going to use army for uh for this particular example so army atk bonus will be 312.5 so once we add these two together we get 423 percent and they are part of the same multiplier that's why we add them together now we need to find all units dmg increase there we go all units dmg increase two percent and army dmg increase 41 percent now together that's 43 percent all right next let's pick a hero so we can do the uh calculations say tywin suppose we're going to calculate uh difference between level 3 atk Level 3 ATK gives us 17.5%. Level 3 rare DMG increase gives us 7.5%. So now we're going to compare which one is better. The 7.5% on DMG or the 17.5% on ATK. To do that, let's assume we are going to take the hero's ATK as well into account. Because uh, remember, the account stats don't actually represent hero stats. So any hero skills, perks, or um, war power will not be reflected in the stats page. Now we're going to add 60.5% ATK to 423%, which gives us a total of 483.5%. Suppose we're going to equip a level 3 rare ATK into our skill slot, which means our 5.835 will get an additional uh, 0 0.175, gives us a total multiplier of 601 for our ATK increase, right? So 601 times 1.43 from DMG increase that we already have. We didn't modify any. We didn't add the uh, level 3 rare skill. It's just what we currently have on the account. And that gives us a total of 8.5943. So now we go back to the calculator to see what the 7.5% DMG would actually do. So our ATK, our original ATK would be 5.835 times. And we're going to add the uh, DMG increase of 0.75 to the existing multiplier of 1.43 and that's going to give us 8.78 we can see 8.78 is already better than 8.59 which means that level 3 dmg skill is better than level 3 atk for my particular account the little damage that i am getting is actually giving me a lot more of final output than the larger sum of atk but now let's do a challenge what if we compare level 3 dmg increase to level 4 atk skill level 4 atk gives us 30 percent so now we just need to calculate the coefficient for level 4 atk increase so we have the original multiplier for ATK increase at 5.835. And now we're going to add an additional 0.3. So now we're at 6135 times the original DMG increase at 1.43. Now, as you notice, 
877-305 is actually lower than what we got with a level 3 DMG skill. That means that level 3 DMG increase is actually better for my particular account than a level 4 ATK increase. That's crazy, guys. That is crazy. But you have to do your own math. And if you don't really understand how this is done, let me know in the comments below and I'll, I'll help you out and I'll uh, maybe even do it for you. If you want to drop me your stats, I don't mind doing it at all. I love math. And uh, yeah, well, there you have it, guys. If you enjoyed the video, a like is always appreciated. If you want to see more future content, subscribe to the channel. I'll see you guys in the next one. Later.